Today is June 30th, 2022, and it is day number 10 of my true hike on Camino del Norte. I'm starting the day in the town of Castro Urdiales. I really enjoyed my stay here, and the idea is to hike another 20 miles to a town on the coast of northern Spain called Laredo. The forecast is for showers throughout the day. It's a chilly morning for summer, but I'm sure it's gonna be another wonderful day on the trail. For those people who are considering hiking Camino del Norte uh, on their own and uh, do not speak Spanish, I find the Camino to be very well signed with uh, the yellow arrows that uh, will keep you on the route. And, uh, and there are many book guides available uh, on the Camino and the, the good thing about the guides is that um, they also list the places the albergues, the places one can stay or the restaurants and bars along the way but um, if you don't want to carry a book because it's going to add weight to your uh, backpack you can also download um, the app called uh, Far Out. They used to be called Gut Hook, but they changed names this year and they are now called Far Out. And uh, the app is free. You can download it for free, but uh, you can uh, you have to buy the maps and uh, and they have the maps for um, Camino del Norte. This is actually what I am doing. So I don't have any uh, uh, printed guide with me. I downloaded uh, the map that they have for the Camino in this app called Far Out and uh, this is what I'm following. It's I recommend this and uh, also I think uh, in general it's uh, very safe um, so one can hike alone here 
uh, with no worries. Either uh, a man or a woman. Uh, I see a lot of uh, uh, women uh, hikers uh, on their own. So, and then once again, uh, one doesn't really need to speak Spanish to uh, to hike in Spain. Uh, on the Camino, most people working for uh, the cafes and the uh, albergues, they speak English. There are people from all different nationalities on the Camino. So uh, there are Germans, French, uh, people who don't speak Spanish at all and they get by with English. This is a beautiful section of Camino del Norte. I'm walking from the town of Castro Urtiale to Laredo. So I'm about uh, four miles from Laredo now and the trail is right next to the ocean. It's just beautiful views and it's a wonderful trail to hike on. I think I was really lucky with the weather. It was raining earlier on and just now it cleared out. So the sky is just so beautiful, blue. And the views of the ocean is just gorgeous. It was a wonderful day on the trail. I hiked 20 miles to the town of Laredo. I arrived at the end of the day. I came to the convent they have here. It's a Franciscan convent and uh, they have an albergue for pilgrims at the convent. And this is where I'll be staying tonight. I'm sure I'm gonna have a peaceful night so I'll be able to rest 
and tomorrow I'll continue my true hike on Camino del Norte to the town of Santiago de Compostela.